Hi, I'm Mike Forte and today I'm going to share with you another traditional recipe which has been handed down in my Italian family for generations. This recipe based on chicken bone broth is highly nutritious and is an excellent natural source of minerals such as calcium, magnesium and phosphorus, as well as important amino acids, glucosamine, collagen and gelatin. It is renowned for its healing properties. Also a very cost effective dish since the main ingredient is regarded by many as a waste product to be discarded. Right, so here we have the uh, raw ingredients. Um, as you can see, we've got uh, the carcasses of two chicken with all the bones. Uh, we've got uh, some vegetables with some onions, carrot, celery, and some parsley. Um, a few bay leaves and some garlic. Um, salt and pepper, optional stock cubes. This is the list of ingredients and a rough costing for the dish. The larger bones should be broken to help release flavour and nutrients. I'm using an electric pressure cooker but a similar result can be obtained by boiling and simmering on a stove for a minimum of three hours but preferably for at least six hours or more. The costing assumes a zero cost for the chicken carcasses as these would otherwise be discarded. Here we have all the ingredients in the pot and uh, we're going to just cover this with water um, and then cook for uh, approximately two hours. So we'll now pass the remaining liquid through a sieve. This can all be compressed down and pushed through. And the result is soup and waste products. Waste products can then be discarded and the soup should be cooled and then refrigerated for at least a few hours. Here we have the soup which has been uh, refrigerated overnight and the next stage is to uh, skim off uh, any fat that's accumulated on the surface and this can be discarded. Some of the product has now been placed in a pan and this should have a, a healthy gelatinous consistency. I've also prepared some uh, pastina which is um, very small pasta. The product has now been brought to the boil and um, I'm now going to add the pastina. Right. Now this can now be simmered and, and stirred for the next 15 minutes. This is the finished product. Excellent.